Welcome back to part 3 of Redux tutorial. In this episode, I will show you how we can make a simple Redux example. So, let's get started. Open your Visual Studio Code or any editor. So, now I have here the Visual Studio Code. As you can see, here I have the Redux library. Uh, it is a production uh, library, it is minified. As you can see uh, this is the Redux library. You can download from the official website of the Redux. So, so let's get started. This is the library, and this is uh, this is not index.js. No, this is this is something else. Yes. Now. I want to work with this okay first of all I want to create uh, I want to create an HTML document as you can see this is our HTML document Redux tutorial demo on okay so here I want to add the Redux library. Okay, script script mm. script is RC lives and then the redux admin.js okay and also I want to create a new folder scripts okay so and inside it I want to create a script.js file okay now I want to add that as rc in this script folder and then the script file okay now we have we added them and then i want to create a dev with the id container okay and then i want to create an h1 with the id count okay and then i want to add some button with the class btn and with the id with id for example at this should be 3 button ok ok oh sorry Sorry about that. Mm. Sorry about that. Okay. Now that's good. This is the minus. This is the remove. Remove. Minus. And add. Okay, now we have this, and I want to create some style there. Okay, I want to contain. Okay, this is a container. Container. Oh, what's that? Okay, no problem. That's okay. So, program color gray and 
splice block also okay 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 line center and font size gel px okay that's enough let run our server by if you don't have the live server you can install by npm install uh, save npm install light server as globally and not save okay by this command or install no problem I have installed it from before npm as you can see npm list g is equal to zero Dev is equal to zero okay no no problem I have installed that from before okay light just run my server and then enter right light server then enter okay as you can see now now it open here okay we can wet One hundred px height height this font size this oh it's very large it's very large Okay. Now it's better than the previous. Okay. Okay. Now if I have default text, for example. Okay, that's great. So let's start with coding of Redux also let me I add background red uh, blue background green background red okay man gram okay that's good now let's Create our Redux here. Okay, first of all, I want to make a variable const, for example, count reducer. Okay, and then yeah, we are the current the current set and the action 
okay now we want we don't want to change they said just uh, because they said as red only we can just change this set by dispatching an action or making an action but here uh, we need to hold the current set and we go to the next set comes next we make a variable next set and this hold an object okay and here we make a variable cnt and the, this cnt we, uh, we hold the current set oh sorry hmm current set dot cnt okay cnt means count and then we have a switch we check the action which action are uh, get get dispatch so we check the type of the action and here we here we have the case if this is the action at then then our next step that cnt is equal to current state dot cnt okay and also this should be incremented and then we return the next state and the another case is the action minus and here we have this also next to dot cnt just we minus them and then return the next that okay so we can copy this and the case remove as the next set that cnt is equal to zero we remove it and we have also default the default we just return here we return the next set and here we return the current set okay okay this is our eraser that's enough okay now I want to make a variable const now I want to create my action const action action at action at here okay and here we return the type at okay just copy this action remove minus minus remove remove okay this is now this is our action okay so now I want to make the initial that is equal to cnt is equal to zero and then i want to 
create the Redux. So const restore okay, is equal to Redux. This Redux cam comes from this library. Okay, that create Redux that create store and here we pass our reducer which at this count reducer and the initial state. Okay. Then we can make a render function then we can subscribe or restore that subscribe subscribe listen to the state change when the state gets changed subscribe function gets called automatically okay Here we can print the store that get state and also document that get element by ID. As you can see here, we have the count. There's that inner text is equal to store dot get stat dot cnt okay and now I want to call the btn at and we create an event when that click when gets click then this function will gets execute okay so in this function I want to I want to the emit the action so by the store we dispatch we dispatch the action at okay action at this is the man Ram Okay. Now let's check that we dispatch first we create a reducer. First we create our reducer our reducer is just a function with two parameters the current state and the action and we make a next set to hold the state as you can see here is we have an object which hold it in the next set and we take the current set that cnt which it means we take this okay now at the first time CNT is zero then we switch that because there's a reuse function when gets execute that that we dispatch an action by the store okay we made an action so here we check the type of the action as the type is add then the next set that cnt which 
which at the first at a zero and we make that the current state that CNT current state is CNT is also zero but we increment it now it is one and it, it hold it to the CNT okay now the CNT has one and we return the next step and then F in the action main dispatch gets dispatched then in the next set the CNT gets increment decrement okay and then we return the next set so if we remove just we make the CNT again zero if they are not this three case match then we return the current set okay so then we create our action exactly this is our action with which we return it from this action add method function and this is our initial state then we create our create store which that takes two parameters we pass our reducer and the initial state okay then subscribe it the subscribe function when gets called that our set gets change when that change we change the count we change the text of that to the CNT the current set okay so the get set that CNT and this is when we click our button okay by clicking btn add we dispatch the action add by clicking the btn main we dispatch the action main and also by clicking the btn ram we dispatch the action ram so let's save and check that okay now if if I click add this does not work why let's check that here in the console as you can see here is action must be plain objects so I think the problem is here we should make it like this because it is a function it is a function so now it works nice as you can see here is our state okay this is our state as you can see it works nice okay this works nice okay so thank you for your watching and see you in the next video goodbye and please don't forget to subscribe my channel